Yahweh. All right, first off, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakam Kodash, the water Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai, for allowing me to do another video, Third Spirit, the water Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai, for giving us his truth as worms, double honors to our apostle elders at Great Millstone, and salutation and blessings to the whole like. It's just a quick in transit about how the Lord will fight for us, man. Because the heavenly father, Yahweh Bashim al Shah, is not a man that he shall lie. And we should believe that. Because if the Lord Yahweh Bashim al Shah said, if we trust in him and, and believe in him, he'll protect us. And it's always been that way. Starting from the beginning, the Lord always told us, as Israel, being his chosen people, the sons of God, if we trust and believe in him, and we do as he says to the best of our ability, he, he'll protect us, he'll provide for us, he'll give us what we need to, to be sustained. But if we go astray from those things, then what? The, the, the heathens shall take us, take us over, we'll be trodden down as mired in the street, all that, man. All that. But now, us turning back to Yahweh by Shimei Al Shai, the Lord Yahweh by Shimei Al Shai is fighting our battles, man. Things in this world may piss you off, people in this world may may piss you off and i have personal testimonies that i know brothers uh, around the four corners of the earth have personal testimonies of how the lord yahweh by shimmy al shah has dealt with somebody that has pissed off pissed them off man and not just like pissed off just to get get you mad but like extremely got under your skin man like you 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 know man you you know when somebody pisses you off man but the Lord Yahweh by Shimei Al Shai has our back, man. He 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 protects us. And when people do wrong unto us, when people do dirt unto us, he gets some back, man. And it may not be immediately, but he eventually gets them back, man, in due time, man. Because the Lord Yahweh by Shimei Al Shai works on his time, man. On his on his on his time, man. When he wants to deal with it, because someone in this world may wrong you. And you may be mad and want to want to do something about it, get carnal, but the spirit tell you no, and and um, and you listen to the spirit. A little while later, you'll see that person that wronged you. They may be dead. They may be dealing with issues, health issues, maybe bugged out. I, I said I remember this one dude I didn't like at a at a job. I, I believe I don't remember. I think I put a curse up on him. I don't, I, I can't, I can't remember, but I would just be throwing up curses up on people because I'd be, I'd be waiting, like, because you throw a curse up on somebody, you better mean it, because you, you, you destroying somebody's life, you better, you better mean it, man, this is, be, be careful you put a curse up on because they, hey, they have power in it, man, there's power in it, just like with a gun, you don't just go around firing a gun off, man, you, you, hey, the curses, are very powerful some dude came in came in my store where i work at and i couldn't even recognize him i was like who the fuck is this because before he was an asshole he, he was he, he was a jake he was clean shaved trying to be like esau he came in looking rugged man i was like who the fuck is this nigga he like what's up man i said what's up he's like you don't remember me i said nah i don't know who you is he said, oh, I'm, I'm so-and-so. I said, oh, shit. What's up? Was, he, man, he was looking rough, man. But that's that's the, that's the power of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. We don't have to do anything, man. The Lord is, we going to eventually get our hands on these people, but the Lord Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai is going to take care of it at the end of, end of the day. We don't have to do anything to anybody. Yeah, people piss us off. Yeah, we put curse up on people. But at the end of the day, the Lord Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai is going to deal with them, man. Nobody is going to be unpunished, man. We are, we Lord willing, we be the prophets of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. The Lord Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai is going to deal with all our enemies, man. Just like with Yahweh Shapat, he was one of the kings of Israel, one of the righteous kings of Israel. And I have to say that because you had a lot of wicked kings of Israel, but he was one of the righteous kings, and. Moab, Ammon, and Esau came up against him. You can go to Chronicles and read, read, read the story about it. Moab, Moab, Esau, and Ammon came up against him to fight. And he prayed unto Yahweh by Shimei Al Shai with the congregation of the, of the people. 
And the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai told him that look, this is what you're gonna do. You you basically gonna stand back and and, and watch me work. That when you go into the to the script, I believe it said the the fight is a it's the Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai's fight. The hand the the get something to that effect. But the the power of winner and loser are in the hands of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. What happened? In, in this in this historic event because it's just not a story it's not some some crazy thing this is history man this is this is our history at that but what happened is Ammon and Moab I believe start fighting against Esau and Edom and they all they all just start warring against each other man they just they forgot how whatever spirit the Lord sent amongst them they started fighting each other man they left off from what they came to destroy Israel. And they end up fighting all against each other, man, and, and eventually destroying each other. And Israel came in and took all the spoils of the battle, man. And the, the spoil was so great, it took three days journey to get everything. And he didn't do, didn't nobody have to go to battle, didn't nobody have to go to war. The Lord Yahweh by Shimei Alshai sent the spirit amongst them and had them start beefing with one another. And they, they killed one another, man. To the point where the spoil was so great it took three days journey man and that's the power we serve man we serve the power of heaven man he controls everything he controls everything man he controls if your fucking car runs man the heavenly father controls if you put your right so right sock on before your left he controls everything this is the Heavenly Father, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh's matrix, man. We have to believe that and we have to know that. We have to trust that he'll be with us, man. This is his world. He can control the matrix, just like they showed in the movie Matrix. When you had the power, when you when you had the, the power, you they realized, look, you got power over this matrix. And the Heavenly Father has that power. He has the power over this matrix. He can open up the ground and close it back up like nothing ever happened. This is the power we serve, man. This is the power that we serve. The power, Yahweh by Shem Shai, man, who can do anything, man, literally anything. Literally give you the ability to fly, man. That's in the scriptures. The ability to pick up a car. The ability to run through a troop. The, this is the power we serve, man. It's, it's crazy, man. But, hey, that's why the scripture says, in Isaiah, I believe it's 55 and 11, it says, Who art thou to be afraid of a man that shall die as the grass, man? Basically, don't fear no man. Don't fear this Esau. Don't fear Esau, man. Fuck Esau, man. He doesn't have the power of of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai. He can't take a soul out of somebody's body. He can't, he can't destroy you, man. He can't destroy a soul. We serve the power of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai who can destroy you, man. Who, who can destroy you mentally, physically, and spiritually. Esau, most he can do is destroy you physically. And that's it. Yeah, he can put shit out there and put propaganda out there to deter the, the, the mind, but he has no power over the spirit. The Heavenly Father has control over all that. So don't fear Esau either, man, because he's just a man. He, he, he sheds blood, man. But we serve a power Yahweh by Shem Yahushua who sheds no blood, man. And what does the Lord say? I shall not meet thee as a man. The Lord is going to meet Esau Edom as a power, as a force, as a as a as an angelic being to destroy, man. But this is just something real quick, man. Hey, don't worry about these people in the world, man. Hey, they they may they they may get you, man. A bitch may leave you. <laughs> A bitch may leave you for a nigga you know, or a nigga you know in the world, and and that nigga gonna get got. But hey, <laughs> a bitch, hey, your family may leave. People gonna talk shit about you, but it's a okay. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good because the heavenly Father is gonna get you for for hurting his servant, man. For 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 pissing off his servant, man. And we're not hey, even even further than that from pissing off his friend. If hey, if somebody, if your friend, if you if a oh, well, good friend, if you don't like somebody, your friend's not gonna like that person. Why? Because that's your friend, man. 
that you, your your enemy is his enemy because he wronged you. And he'll do the same if your friend went after him. And what did the Lord call us? He called us friends. He said, I no, no longer hence call you servants, but I call you friends because the servant knows not what his master doeth. But but ye are ye are friends because we know we know what Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is doing, man. We know where Yahweh Shah is. Why? Because we're his friend. This man has heavy, man. Lord willing, we be a part of that number, man. We are friends of the ultimate beings, man. That hey, what does the scripture say? Wisdom make it friends of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. Abraham, man, he was a friend of Yahweh. It says that that he was friends, man. That that that's out of this world, man. That's that is that's, that's man, like that's man, man. To be called a friend of God, <laughs> that's amazing, man. That's fucking amazing. But Lord, we'll hope this lesson was edifying. All praise be to you, by Shimmy, how shy, man. Our power and and. Hey, the Lord got our backs, man. We just we just gotta trust Him. We gotta believe in Him and, and, and continue in this work. So with that, all praise be to Al Bashir Al Shai. With that, shalom.